Redlands Police Department has a long history of using a technology to work smarter. Uh, it would be a force multiplier. So data drives all that we do, right? Because you can just do what police departments have typically done, you know, for decades, you know, over a hundred years, and just hope you're in the right place at the right time. Or you can really try and, and be more strategic about it. And so we use data to be very strategic. Back in 2010, we went from 96, 97 officers down to 72. We were having vehicle burglaries at the LA Fitness parking lot. It was every, basically every other day we'd be taking reports where someone would break a wind car window, steal somebody's laptop, steal somebody's purse, go use the credit cards. Right around that same time, the banks were for switching from switching from die packs to GPS trackers. One, one night, two o'clock in the morning, I was signing off a, re, a report. Um, I was like, why can't we use that technology and put it in a laptop computer? Ultimately, we cleared 12 vehicle burglaries with, between those two guys. We, we started uh, teaching across the nation on this technology and that, on that um, one of those conferences, we met Flock Safety. Going to an ALPR program is really the logical next step because it's all about having the right information to impact crime. And so the fact that you know we've gone over a couple things, right? Having the data put the officers in the, the right place at the right time. Um, the, uh, the fact that a lot of our crime is committed by people who are coming from outside of Redlands. They're not riding bikes here. Um, they're not walking here for the most part. What are they doing? They're driving cars. What does virtually every car have? A license plate. So when you get to ALPRs, the, that is like the, the marriage of all these components. Flock uh, sent us a test camera. We made some adjustments, made some recommendations. We ended up purchasing five, five cameras. And from that five cam those five cameras, it's grown into 24 cameras. Um, Redlands Police Department only pays for those five cameras. All the other cameras are funded by businesses, uh, residents, um, uh, and different uh, uh, groups that are willing to come together and help us protect our community because all the privacy concerns are addressed. Solving crime is like putting a puzzle together. You get a box of a bunch of jumbled pieces and you're putting all the pieces together and the trick with these puzzles is you don't get all the pieces and you know you're gonna get most of the picture but probably not all of it but ALPR is another piece of this puzzle that's huge and so when you start getting all these components you're really able to impact crime.